Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. We are going to do an all signs Aries through Pisces. What are their current feelings for you? And we are going to get an angel number for each one. We are going to start with Aries. Keep in mind, it is a general collective. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. If you want your own personalized reading, my website is timelessdivinetarot.com. I do have a 24 to 48 hour turnaround. Okay, let's start with Aries first. Your angel number, 5129. So you can look that angel number up. 5129. How does Aries persons feel about them right now? Okay, Nine of Pentacles. Aries, your person sees you as somebody who's super independent, somebody who is very loving, very caring. They see you as, as somebody who is coming towards them with love and affection. You maybe had been indecisive in the past, but it looks like you are enjoying your independence, but you are still spending a lot of time with them. This person does feel that you are somebody that they could potentially fall in love with. They do want to protect this connection at all costs. Taurus. Six, seven... Eight. So 678 Taurus is your angel number. Let's see how your person currently feels about you, Taurus. Queen of Wands, Two of Swords, and Justice. Truthfully, Taurus, your person sees you as a firecracker. You are somebody who is really inspiring to them, and it almost makes them confused because you are doing so much with your life. You're so fast-paced, so creative, that it makes them feel like they're not doing the right thing. They're not balancing things out by bringing to the table as much as you are. But they are feeling inspired to step up. The truth is that you are a true inspiration to this person. Gemini. One, 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 five is your angel number. Gemini, how does your person feel about you in the current energy? Gemini. Nine of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and Page of Wands. Uh, Gemini, your person wants to tell you the truth is that they see you as somebody who doesn't need someone, that you're very attractive, you have your life together, you're at peace, you're, you're living your best life. They see you don't need someone, but they hope you want them. This is an individual that doesn't want you to walk away from them because they are feeling inspired and curious to see if you like them as much as they like you. Cancer. One, two, one, zero. So 12, 10 angel number. Cancer. How does Cancer's person feel about them in the current energy? Cancer. You could be dealing with a Leo. Cancer. How does Cancer's person feel about them? Nine of Swords, Ten of Wands, Queen of Swords. Did you break up with them? Because this person feels like you have completely broke the connection down. You've packed your bags. You've left them. You've maybe moved out. And you were very clear about what you wanted, and they were not a part of that future. They feel really sad right now. They feel helpless. They feel wounded about the situation between the two of you. They are hoping and waiting that you're going to return. Leo, 1153, 1153. Leo, how does your person feel about you? How does Leo's person feel about them and the current energy? The Fool, Leo, this person, Four Swords, Knight of Swords. Honestly, Leo, this person's thought long and hard about you. This person really wants to run and open up lines of communication that they want to have a new beginning. They want this opportunity to have a new commitment with you. Look at, you're coming up at the bottom of the deck. This person is really working up their inner strength and courage, Leo, to let you know that they do want to start over. Virgo. Three, one, two. Three, twelve, Virgo is your angel number. Let's see how your person currently feels about you, Virgo. Chariot, they could be at a distance. They see you at a distance. Eight of swords and empress. We also got the nine of cups at the bottom of the deck. So, Virgo, it does feel like this person feels like you're moving on that you are no longer investing into this connection. They see you as wanting to live your best life single and that you're happy being single. 
Libra. 755. All right, Libra, how does your person feel about you? Libra. Libra's person. Three of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, and Four of Pentacles. They see you holding back for them, Libra. They see that you are very confident and being let you're holding back. They feel that you are somebody who's holding out till you get what you want, but you're waiting. That's how they feel. They feel like you're waiting. Maybe you're waiting for this opportunity of commitment from them, and this person is not giving it to you. Scorpio. One, seven, five. Scorpio, your angel number is one, seven, five. You could be dealing with a Gemini. What is Scorpio's person's feelings for Scorpio in the current energy? Ten of Wands, Knight of Swords, Queen of Swords. Who's this other person? Oh, Knight of Wands. Scorpio, your person is feeling inspired to figure out what the truth is here. Do they even have any pull to win you back? Because they feel like you have left them. You've completely disregarded this connection that you broke up with them and then you left. And it could be because you were bored. You were bored and discontent. And this person felt it energetically, but they never said anything. So this person feels that you have made your decision that you don't want them and that you're done with them. They feel like you've turned your back on them, Scorpio. Sagittarius. Eight, nine, one. Okay, Sagittarius, that's your angel number. Eight, nine, one. Let's see what your person's current feelings for Sagittarius are. Sagittarius's person, what's the current feelings? Seven of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Swords, the Sun. You could be dealing with the Leo. Uh, Sagittarius, your person feels like you're lying to them about some type of level of commitment or some sort. They feel like you are saying that you're not happy with them, but it looks like you are. There's this heavy energy of happiness here, but it comes after a lot of hurt and pain. You could have children with this person. You could share a family with this person or had a family with this person. This person feels like you're lying about um, potentially not being happy with them. I'm hearing that you may want to open up when it comes to this person. Capricorn, seven, is that nine, three, seven, nine, three, angel number Capricorn. Let's see how your person feels about you, Capricorn. Capricorn. Capricorn's person. Emperor, you could be dealing with an Aries, Hierophant, Taurus, Eight of Pentacles. Honestly, Capricorn, this person feels like you're married to your job. You're committed to your job, that you're in, in maybe a, some type of authoritative type position. Your person feels like you're moving too slow for a higher level of commitment that you really only care about your job or your career. Aquarius. One, two, so 12, 10, 7. Aquarius, your angel number, 12107. Those are your numbers. Aquarius, how does your person currently feel about you? Aquarius. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Swords, Ten Ten, and the Tower. Something's changed, uh, Aquarius. Your person feels like you have changed up on them. That at one moment you were really, really happy and content. Maybe you had a family or children with them. But then something happened. Something changed in the connection. This person is trying to rebuild their confidence of getting you on the same page as them, but they don't see that. So right now they could be trying to listen to their intuition, which is guiding them on how to gain stability when it comes to this connection. Pisces, eight, seven, 11. Okay, Pisces, how does your person currently feel about you? Pisces. Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, and the Fool. Honestly, Pisces, your person wants a new beginning. This person wants an opportunity. They want to clear the air. They want to start over. They're very confident that they do want to take this leap of faith. They want to come towards you. They want to reestablish if this is a person from the past. If it's a new person, they want to have a go at it. They want to have a go at actually having a relationship with you.